Are you still not pregnant? Don't feel discouraged. You're getting the hang of things now. Did you know that the likelihood of conceiving in one menstrual cycle of a woman is approximately 20 to 25% per cycle, dependent on age? It's important to keep this statistic in mind as it reminds us that it can take months of consistency to successfully conceive. There are some important next steps for you in the meantime. For example, have you confirmed that you are ovulating yet? This is the perfect cycle to confirm ovulation. An LH peak is a good predictive indicator that ovulation will occur. However, utilizing basal body temperature tracking, also known as BBT, you can confirm that you truly did ovulate and that there's plenty of pregnancy promoting progesterone around for when you do conceive. It's essential to confirm that you are ovulating because it is possible to get a positive LH peak without actually ovulating. If you aren't pregnant yet, this is an important piece of information you can easily collect utilizing something as simple as a basal body temperature thermometer. Let's talk about confirming ovulation with BBT. BBT, or basal body temperature, is your body temperature at rest and can be only accurately taken immediately when you wake up. BBT rises after ovulation due to increased progesterone released from the corpus luteum after ovulation. The hormone progesterone actually has a thermal effect that raises your total basal body temperature when it is present in high amounts. Ovulation can be detected on a BBT chart one to three days before the BBT spike. Your body's basal body temperature will spike one half to a full degree Fahrenheit 24 to 36 hours after you ovulate and remain elevated until your next period where it dips again, or your BBT will remain high if there is a pregnancy. A cover line of your BBT will be drawn in your pre-mom chart directly above the last low temperature before the BBT spike. The purpose of this cover line is to separate lower pre-ovulatory temperatures from higher post-ovulatory temperatures so the BBT spike can be more easily observed. With successful ovulation, you can expect to see lower temperatures in the first half of your cycle and higher temperatures in the second half of your cycle. This is what makes BBT an affordable and effective means of confirming ovulation. You might be wondering, how do I do it? It's best if you can record your temperature around the same time each morning, immediately upon waking. The more consistent you can be, the better. BBT is different from other fertility testing in that it needs to be done every single day, immediately upon waking, around the same time each day. It's also important to know that you need at least three hours of undisrupted sleep before testing for best accuracy. Moving even just to go to the bathroom, talking or drinking water can all change that delicate reading. What makes a BBT thermometer different than a regular oral thermometer? BBT thermometers extend an extra decimal place. This allows for more detailed temperature readings than a standard oral thermometer would. Premom offers you multiple tools to predict and confirm your ovulation. Premom even sells a smart Bluetooth basal thermometer that will automatically add your temperature to the Premom app and chart to increase your accuracy while testing. Now you know how to confirm ovulation, making you one step closer to conceiving that bundle of joy.